Hey guys, hope all of you are doing good. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another interesting SQL problem. This has been commonly asked in a lot of tech company interviews again. So here we have the employee slash manager table, okay? So we have the name of the employee, the ID of the employee, his or her salary and who is their manager. For example, John's ID is one and the manager ID of John is the three, right? So if you scroll down the list, we see the ID number three is actually Santi which means Santi is actually the manager of John. Similarly, Henderson's manager number is ID number four, which means number four, this guy, right? Manuel is the manager of Henderson, okay. Now, we wanna write a query to find which employees are earning more than their managers, okay? That's a very unusual thing, but we wanna check that here, okay? And also remember, these two people do not have any managers assigned to them, okay? So how we can approach this question is by using the concept of self-join, okay? So let me do this. So I'll, I will do a dot star like from this table and I will simply join it with the same table. This is what is called as self-join, okay? Copy it with the same table. I mean, I join it with the same table. So I will also select B dot star. Let's see what kind of output we get, okay? And I'll put one extra condition. So as you see, in in this case, the IDs here are actually the same as the manager IDs here, right? So let's try and join the ID from first table, right? A dot ID and second table, which also has the same four rows. But this time, let us join it with manager ID and see what's happened. Now, when I run this, as you see, First table we get, you know, basically these uh, four columns. Second table we get the same four columns, but basically the people who are the subordinates of these two managers, right? If you remember, John was the subordinate of Santi or Santi was the manager of John and Manuel was the manager of Henderson, right? By joining ID from first table and manager ID from second table, we are able to arrive at this place, right? That is already one step done. Now here if we see, um, John is making more than Santi. So John is definitely earning more than his manager, right? He's earning 70K, his manager is only earning 60K. And in the second case, Henderson is earning 80K, but Manuel, and who is Henderson's manager, is earning more. So we don't want this row. For that, what can we do? We can simply put a condition where uh, A dot salary, so the salary on the left, right? For example, your manual salary is, uh, less than b dot salary salary of the subordinate basically right these two so when i run this then we get only one row right this is the row where santi who happens to be the manager of john is earning less than john right and if we want to just show the name of the person i will just say i will remove everything from the a table i will just put b dot name so i will just get this guy's name john now when i run the query i get john if I want to see who is his manager, I will say a dot name also. So we can see Santi and John. So this combination, the manager is earning less than the employee, right? Which is a bit weird, but yeah, that's how it works. Okay. I hope you enjoyed the question. I will see you again in another video. Till then, take care.